Hi guys, I am doing a plan with me today and I'm so excited because I've missed doing these so much. It's been forever and a half uh, since I did one of these and I really missed it. I've been so busy cutting stickers and everything that I just kind of like push these to the side. But I'm going to be planning my week today and it is going to be my actual week as well. So um, I decided to hold off on planning it out to just do it with you guys because I thought it'd be really fun. So this is my personal planner that I use for like every week for just my life, for work, everything is all in this planner. Um, and I love this one. This is my favorite. It's like my dream planner with like the rose gold coil and the rose gold cover. But anyways, so we're going to get into it, but first I'm going to show you guys the kit I'm using this week, and it is Boss Babe, and this is the kit that will be released on Friday, this Friday at 9 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. This is the new kit. Um, I know a lot of shops have already done uh, kits with this clip art, so I don't know how popular it's going to be. I designed this one back like mid-December or like late December when this clip art came out, but I wasn't able to get it up until now because of the schedule that I had set. So um, yeah, I wasn't able to get it up until now. But maybe some of you who either really love this clip art may also want to get another version of it, or if you um, like didn't pick it up when other shops are selling it, this would be like the great, the great time to get it. So I'm going to zoom you guys in and show you guys the kit. So here is the front page. I love this Weekend Manor so much. And you have this girl here, which is so gorgeous, and then all the different designs. And it's very like February-esque. This is a very pale pink. Um, it's a lot easier to see in person than on camera. But I love the fuchsia and the dark red and the gray. I think it's so pretty. Here are the full ombre checkbox thingies. <laughs> I have glitter along the bottom one, which I've been loving using like a pattern or glitter down here. Um, I think it's gorgeous. And then this is the uh, functional page that's like the newer version, uh, which I love. I love how this is working out. Let me know in the comments below if you guys are liking this new format of the kit because I love it personally, but most importantly is what you guys like. So let me know down below if you're liking it. And then the normal washi page and then the full boxes, which I love these. And I use two different skin tones in this one. Um, I always get a lot of questions about that. So there's one full box here with her, that skin tone and this full, this half box with this skin tone. Um, I won't have options like for different one, like different versions of it. This will just be the only version because I'm not able to stock enough like to do different versions. Um, since I'm not, not ready, I mean I'm ready to ship since I'm not like made to order. Um, it's really difficult for me to like stock multiple versions of a kit. So since I'm ready to ship, um, I only am able to have this one version. So here's the full box and it says there is no force equal to a woman determined to rise, which I love. I think this would be a great Valentine's Day kit actually, but I'm using it this week because I like it and because it's coming out this week. And then the um, deluxe sheet that's just a whole bunch of goodness just like a whole bunch of useful stuff in here so let me know how you guys are liking the new reformat of this as well i personally am loving it i'm using way more stickers than i did before when it was a different type of deluxe sheet uh before i like you know updated it but yeah and then there is the glitter headers and the checklist flags i'm not going to be using these because i'm using the ombre boxes because i think they're so pretty but this is what this will look like okay so um, let's see. It is the last week of January, first week of February. So where are we in the planner for that? Here. Got it. Okay. So here we go. This is good because this is Monday morning today when I'm filming this and it's going to help me kind of get my week together, get my bearings again. So this is going to be kind of a long chatty one, I think. I don't know if I'm going to speed it up much. We'll see. But I'm going to start with the washi and put this down here. Okay, there's that. I haven't done one of these in so long. It's kind of like, what, like, what do I talk about? <laughs> you know, like what, what do I usually talk about in these? I've missed doing this though. Like I've missed just kind of sitting down and just randomly chatting with you guys. Um, I'm hoping to do more of these in the future, but I can't commit to any just because things get really hectic, but yeah, I'll try. I'm gonna try my best. Okay, now I like to go through with the glitter headers. Um, and this is how I've been kind of doing my weeks lately. I go through the glitter headers and then the normal headers. I always do my to-do list checklist in the middle and then like the top I'll do like important reminders for the day or like just things that are different that I know I need to get done that day. That's not like part of my typical schedule. That's kind of what I put up here. And then down here I put my little things and like a few of the things I need to do in the evenings or something like that or like just like me time, kind of schedule that out just to kind of mentally help me block out that time as like I can just hang out. So... 
that color, and then I'm gonna do this one. Now I'm going to go in with my today, or no, my to-do header, sorry. <laughs> I use the to-do ones. I don't really use the today anymore. Um, I do use the little things, and I'll show you guys how I use that, but I'm going with my to-do, so I can do my checklist in the middle. Okay, so now I'm gonna be going in with my checklists. Okay, now those are all down. I like to go back in with glitter headers again and just cover up that gray bar down here. Just because I kind of feel like it adds a little bit of like structure to it a little bit too. Like it blocks off that rest of that section and it's like that's done with for my to-do lists. So that's how that looks. Um, and then I'm going to go in with my little things and I just like to put a meal down, a meal one down for each um, day, except for on the weekends because I don't really do little things on the weekends. Now I'll put down my TV shows for the little things. And I think I have two shows on Monday, which is today. And <laughs> tonight we have Shadow Hunters and The Bachelor. So exciting. If you guys watch The Bachelor, how are you guys liking it? Like Corinne is like too much for me to handle, <laughs> to be honest. That cheese pasta, I like saw um like a article on Facebook. Someone like talked to Corinne's nanny about like what what was in the cheese pasta, and it was literally just cheese and pasta and like no butter or like garlic salt or like salt or anything. It was hilarious. She's pretty funny. Okay, and then on Tuesday I have Real Housewives of Beverly Hills, which I really like that show. I like all of those honestly. <laughs> They're like really good to cut stickers to because they kind of just like they're long and they're not too like involved Like you don't have to really follow much. It's just very like easy Lighthearted type of stuff And I think that's all the shows. Oh wait the hundreds coming back Wednesday. I haven't seen that show in forever So I don't even know if I'm still kind of into it or not, but we'll see I kind of get over shows a lot like I go through moods and phases with shows on like what I want to watch Oh, and then rent is due Wednesday. Holy cow, that was quick. So we'll put a bill due sticker down for that. That was, January was like literally the quickest month. <laughs> that went by so fast. And February's gonna go by fast too because it's only 28 days. Crazy man, crazy. So, um, okay, what else do we have here? Packages, I think I have two packages coming today, but I only have one package sticker. So we're gonna rope them both into this little thing which is exciting. And then I don't think I have any other packages right now. Um, I need to order supplies Tuesday, like some basic supplies off Amazon, um, like blades and cutting mats and stuff like that. So those will probably come Thursday. So I'll just put one down for Thursday because I have the two day Amazon Prime. So I'll just put that down in anticipation. And that's all I have for now. I tend to just put down um, some extra little things in here just in case something pops up during the week. Um, but if I don't fill it in, it really doesn't matter to me because, I don't know, I want it to look pretty, but I don't care about it being super pretty. It's mostly just functional for me. So I put down a package um, thing on Wednesday in case I order something and it ends up coming Wednesday. Things tend to just tend to just pop up like <laughs> I order things all the time for the shop so things tend to just pop up and then I put a heart down for Friday just as kind of like a miscellaneous in case something happens on Friday where I need to write down and I'll do that again for Thursday too. I tend to just kind of put like a heart down. Um, sometimes it gets filled in sometimes it doesn't like if something pops up I'll fill it in um, and I'll use that because it hearts really like versatile to be kind of whatever you want um, but if nothing pops up it tends to just be blank and I honestly don't mind that's it's fine with me so um, it's just, like I said, more of a functional thing for me than anything else. So I think that everything I'm going to put down for the little things tomorrow, I'm not going to put down a heart just because I know like nothing's really going to be happening tomorrow because I would know already <laughs> since it's already Monday. But I'm going to go down um, with my little things. I'm going to put those on the headers and I just kind of put those on top just because I think it kind of helps block it, especially with the way that my little things are set up where they have this little white border thing in the middle. I think this looks so pretty as like capping it, like trying to cap it off. I think it makes it more like a unit, you know what I mean? 
I don't know. I really like how that looks. So that's what I've been doing. And there's this. And that. Oops. Okay. So now I'm going to go in with, let's just do date covers real quick. Actually, first I'm going to put down these flags because they kind of get overlapped on this side for the date cover. So put down the little flags. Oh, I'm excited that it's going to start saying February up here instead of January. Like, that'll be fun. And it's less of a little loop-de-loop, -loop, so you can put it up higher, which will be nice. And that there. Okay, so let's do the date covers real quick. Where's my pen? I use the um, Paper Mate Ink Joy gel pens, the 0.7. This is my absolute favorite pen. I have, like, every color. It's my favorite. <laughs> 30, 31, first, second third, fourth, and fifth. I have some date covers. Um, some of you guys might have saw them last week. They went up, or date dots, sorry. Little date dots to put in these that fit really well. Um, and those will actually sold out pretty fast. Some of you, I think, kind of like, some of you knew, I think, that I was doing putting them up. And I think because I mentioned it on um, Instagram at some point, but, and quite a few of you snagged them. But I'm going to be restocking those this week as well. So if you do want some date dots, they're pretty simple. They're just like, two sets of like um, one through 31 and one of them is like a grayscale and then the other one I think I did was like pink because of February. I figure a lot of people will be doing pink spreads so I wanted to do a pink one and that would change up probably as we go through different months, the different colors. Um, okay, so now I want to do the weekend side. So for the weekend, I cover all of it with full boxes. I don't really use full boxes throughout the week um, but I do use them here. So um, let's see which ones I want to do. They're all so pretty. It's the hard part. So I'm going to have the weekend banner over it. So I want it to kind of go. Where is that? Here. So I want it to kind of stand out, like not be too much. I think I might do just the plain glitter one here. We're going real glittery with this. It's a little crooked, but I honestly, I don't mind. I don't want to pull that back up. <laughs> and then we'll go with this one, with the tassels. It's super cute. Okay. And then I'm going to put down this weekend banner. I think that's pretty. Love that. So cute. And then I honestly, I love all these full boxes. I love these too. So I think I'm going to use these here. I'm going to do this one here, I think. She is stunning. And then I'm going to use this one here. Okay. I love that. Love that. I think that looks Awesome. I try to keep the weekends pretty like bare because I try to not work on weekends. The last couple ones I have been trying to get pre-sale stuff done, um, which those of you, I've been getting a lot of message about this actually. The pre-sales from right before Christmas, December 23rd, the ladies who launched it was my 10K pre-sale, like exclusive event. Um, the processing time for those were five to six weeks because they're unlimited stock. So those are scheduled to ship Friday or by Friday, but I got a lot of them out last Friday and I am getting the rest of them out today. So that's kind of what I'm working on today. And then I'm going into this week's restock on like the rest of the week. Um, so if you messaged me or had questions about those, they're coming. They'll be out early still because they're still scheduled to go out the third. That's the date that they are supposed to ship by. So they'll still, they're going out earlier, just not super early. I just had a ton of them to get through and I had to do them on the weekend. So um, yeah. But I try to keep the weekends mostly free if I can and try to take off on the weekends now just so I can have like time to take a break and like breathe and relax and like have fun and like, you know, obviously not work, which is like the goal for a lot of people on the weekends. <laughs> so I still design and stuff like that, but um, just to not be like cutting stickers all weekend in my office, that's not like fun after a while, you know, you need some time off to breathe. Uh, okay, so I'm going to put the quote box up here, which I love. And... Oh, it's so hard to get it straight. This whole new star bar deal. Love it. But also, it's very hard to get it straight. I remember those, like, old boxes that went to the top in, like, last year's Erin Condren planner. Those were so much easier. But this does look a lot prettier, though. So, okay. And then I'm going to go in with, I really like, I just really like all of these. Let's see. I think I'm going to go in with this one. I don't really use all my full boxes. We're gonna put that down there for the sidebar. And then I like to do, um, let's see. I like to do my schedule on the side and I'll do my work schedule for the week. 
like what days I'm cutting things and packing things and stuff like that. So I'm going to put that here. I kind of want to put a little bit of washi down first. Let's use a little bit of glitter because there's a lot of this. So I'm going to put that down. Oops. Need two hands for this one. Put that there. I'm going to put my schedule here. I don't put a whole lot down on the sidebar. I'm going to use this one because I just love that color. And then I like to do, I'm going to put more glitter down. It's going to be kind of like a simpler sidebar, which is fine by me. I love me a good simple sidebar. Put down a weekly tracker. I usually use these for exercise. I'm probably not going to be really exercising much this week because I'm still like on antibiotics. I'm still not feeling that hot, but I will put that there anyways. And then I like to put over that instead of writing an exercise, I just use this exercise header and just kind of stick that over the top. So cute. I actually really love that sidebar. I love that it's all very like darker. I like that a lot. So today, Monday, I'm filming, editing, uploading this plan with me. So I'm going to put a half back half backs, half box <laughs> at the top of um, these days. So let's see. I know I want to put, I want to use this girl in here somewhere because she's so stunning. But I also don't want to write on her because she's also so stunning. <laughs> um, okay, I'll just put her up here and hope I don't want to write on her too much. Okay, and then I'm going to put for Monday... I think I'm going to put, let's put this, just this pink one and kind of keep it simple at the top here. And then I like to just do half boxes across the top and then we'll do a pattern one. There's just so many pretty prints in this, like patterns. They're just stunning. And then I like to do this one here and I'm going to do this one sideways because this is the new release slash restock day. So I have to put that sideways and just list out what I'm releasing. And for that, I will also put on a, a flag. I'm just pulling in a lot of this glitter accent. I just love it. Okay, perfect. And then I'll also put down like, I'll just put like a little heart here. Because I think that's so cute. That's adorable. Okay, I have enough room for a half box down here. So I might just put a half box there. What's happening Tuesday? Not a whole lot. Or maybe I'll leave it blank. I honestly love when there's more like white space in the spread. It just helps me kind of keep my like mentalness clear. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, Friday night I like to put a sticker down for date night. And I think I might do... I'll do this one. So it's pretty. And then I'll just use the date night sticker from here. Now let's just put that there. I'm going to put down this cute little planner down here on Sunday because I like to put that there. And then I'll also put down this here because I need to put up the listings and get prepare those for Friday. Just trying to figure out. Okay. Okay, and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to go through with um, these little half quarter boxes, I mean. I'm going to use one here and I'm going to use one Wednesday because these are the days I respond to Etsy messages. So also side note to people who want to get a hold of me, if you ever need to get a hold of me, um, Etsy is the best way to do it. I know that sometimes people try messaging me on, um, direct message me on Instagram, but it never notifies, ne notifies, it never notifies me when I get one of those messages on, um, Instagram because I don't know why, it just doesn't notify me, so I always forget to check them. So if I ever don't respond to your direct message on Instagram, please message me on Etsy. I'm not ignoring you or anything. I honestly doubt, I, I mean, I probably never saw it because I just never check them because I always forget because they never notify me. So Etsy messages, though I check three times a week, Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, and it's usually in the evenings. So I usually check them because I'm like cutting stickers all day and working. So then I usually just check them at night on my computer um, so yeah, so that's the time that I'll be responding typically. Um, if you message me and you're like, why hasn't she responded? Or like, where is she? Um, Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays are in the evenings are when I work on Etsy messages. So that is when I'd be getting back to you. Um, yeah. 
so that's that and I don't respond to them on the weekends because I try not to um, I try not to check them because <laughs> I try to not be working but sometimes I do but yeah Monday Wednesdays and Fridays are like the days I'm on Etsy messages at night let's see I'm gonna pull in my very loved munchkins from once more with love um, oh, I forgot I have some of the wacky holidays left for January. I forgot to order the February one, so I don't have those. But I can finish out these. And I like to just kind of put them down here. So cute. Okay. And then I have like a bajillion and one of these. So like I am obviously obsessed. So I went through and kind of like sorted through all of them and just pulled out all the ones that I think I'm going to need this week, which is what I typically do. And now I'm going to just kind of go through and put them where I need them. So hair washing day, let's say we'll do that. How about Wednesday? I think Wednesday would be a good day. Um, and I'll just put this one down here. And then, what is it? Oh, okay. Um, I'll just put her there. I honestly fill my spread with munchkins because they make me smile. <laughs> And like I said, like I, and sometimes I put way too many where it's probably not cute anymore because I like literally fill every space with munchkins, but I don't care because they make me smile. So that's all that matters. Like I love it. So that's what's important, I think. <laughs> um, and so I'm cutting. Okay, so today I'm cutting and packing the rest of the um, pre-sales. That is what I'm working on. Re cutting all the rest of the matte ones and getting those out and a few of the glossy and then Tuesday, oh, let's do Taco Tuesday. Been loving doing that. Did that last week. That was super fun. So I'm going to put just one of these, like, smaller. I don't think I need, like, a full thing for Taco Tuesday. Cause I love these. They're so cute. I'm going to do this girl. <laughs> Cracks me up. Love them so much. And then um, I don't use one all the time, like all of these, because I could go through these like nobody's business, but I don't use them always when I'm cutting stuff. Sometimes I'll do do that, but. And then a face mask. I would love to do a face mask this week, maybe Thursday, because I kind of have some space there, it looks like. And probably need something relaxing after a busy, busy week. So I'll put that there. And then also I'm going to be packing orders hopefully Friday I've been really loving like powering through um cutting orders during or cutting kits during the week and then just like busting out all the orders Friday I'm hoping to get back to that last week I wasn't able to because I was so sick and I was working on pre-sale stuff to catch up and uh so this week hopefully I can get that back on track once I get all the pre-sale orders out that would be great and then and usually Saturday morning, I actually also, I am guilty of Saturday morning packing orders as well. <laughs> so I'll put that there. And then, um, yeah, let's see. Sometimes I like to put down like reading in the evenings just because it kind of like, I like to carve out some kind of like me time, but I don't think I will have much time for that this week. And then let's do, this one's kind of pretty. I think I'm just going to put this here just because. I feel like, you know what, some little inspiration during the week, girl bossing it. So then today I'm filming and editing. Oh, that's what that should have been actually. Let's see if I can move her. Yeah, she's okay. I'm gonna put this down here because I need to cut those first, which I'll put that there. And then I need to, I'm filming this today. This is like the big thing of today and editing and uploading it, but I'm just gonna use that for now. I'm also going to use this little coffee girl that I need coffee because <laughs> that's so cute because it's Monday so I'm gonna put that in there makes me smile and then this one I'll put it on Friday because these are adorable maybe like a little celebration one for new releases and then I need to do dishes this week blah 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 I mean obviously but I like need to get through some of these earlier this week and so maybe I'll put those for Tuesday no, I don't have time tonight because tonight I'm packing orders. I'll put that there. So cute. And then I also have some Happy Meal coming tonight. Like I said, I have a package from Victoria's Secret, which is super exciting because I don't buy stuff from there often. But I got a cute um, zip-up like sweatshirt that looks super cozy and comfy, and I'm excited for that. So I kind of want to put something a little special there for that. Um, I think I'm just going to like just write on the page there and just do... Happy Meal. Put her here. 
oh, Sunday is the Super Bowl. That's right. So I don't really watch football at all. I did cheerleading for like six or seven years growing up, but I really love to dance and cheer. I didn't really care about football that much. <laughs> so um, I'm not really a football person that much, but my boyfriend, Austin, and we live together. He is super about football, super about football. He is really about football. He's super into it, <laughs> not super into it, but he does like football. So we're going to be watching that and um, I want to make snacks. So I love snacks. That's what I love. <laughs> so let's make some good snacks this Super Bowl. So I'll put that there on Sunday because I know he'll want to watch it, which means we'll just be at home kind of thing. And I kind of want to make yummy snacks for it because that sounds like a fun time. So maybe I'll put like a little cheers thing here. Yeah, that's cute. Okay, perfecto. So I think that's everything for this week. I have a lot of different icons here, which would be super cute, but I don't really need them right now. Um, yeah, I don't really need them at the moment. So here is the full spread. This is like I said, the um, Boss Babe kit. I don't even know if I said that. I hope I said that in the beginning. <laughs> this is the Boss Babe kit coming out Friday. I will also be um, restocking the March monthly kits and that will be a final restock for the March Monthly. This will be restocked again next week if it sells out. Um, I'm not anticipating it to be super popular because I think a lot of big shops already used this artwork. So I think a lot of people already got their kits, but hopefully you guys like it still. And um, it's definitely, I think it has a little bit of a different take on it, like a little different twist. And then I'll also be restocking the functional items, the page flag, um, appointment boxes like these things that are in like full sheets and the glitter half boxes those will be restocked I'll be restocking the uh, date dots but those will be limited quantities and yes I think that's everything for this week I think that's everything that we're we're doing uh, yeah so I hope you guys like this spread and I will also be getting out uh, if you have open orders now I'm hoping to get this out either today or tomorrow so that is this week. I hope you guys liked it, and I hope you guys kind of liked this play with me video. It was nice talking to you guys again, and hopefully I'll be able to do this again, um, like, in the future weeks. I can't commit to any particular week, <laughs> but uh, hopefully I'll be able to do them more in the future, now that kind of, like, my pre-sale stuff is done, so my weekends will be a little bit more free again. So yeah, thumbs up this video if you liked it. Let me know in the comments below, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye!